All right, we're about to cook up these Valorant pickums. At the end of Valorant Champions, I'll like do a punishment or a variety of punishments. That's actually such a great fucking idea. Crew versus Paper X. I feel like, I feel like this one's a little bit of like a give me, like an obvious one. Crew, they're on a little bit of a miracle run. I'll give them that. But Paper X, they have something now, bro. They were the third best team in the world with a content creator. So I, I really want, I really like Giants. I really want Giants to win. This whole game is just class. Yours gonna throw TP down long, and then they're gonna breach Dun at the same time as the Omen Blind TP. Listen, Chow puts him down. Chow puts him down, but like that that long take is gonna be real fucking hard to stop later in the game. Navi take control. They're sending their TP through again. The Omen's ready. Watch. They're gonna blind stun and Omen blind. Shao, and then like, and the fake, like, this is just like unbelievable stuff. But yeah, f this Fitinho guy, he he might be the person that people talk about. Flash, stun, TP, their set plays to take space are very very good. But I don't think the team as a whole can like create plays after the set piece i'm probably gonna pick giants to go through though i think crew like this is where the fairy tale run comes to an end i don't know dude i don't fucking know like they're both so good so that's the thing is like the can can jets way better than the can can rays i don't fucking know dude uh I i'll have to give it to paper x bro i think paper x are more flexible role wise edward can compete on raised maps that take might come back to bite me in the ass but fuck it i don't care you know what i'm gonna make the first hot take the very first fucking hot take bro giants are gonna send edg back to fucking china bro they're gonna send them home the the fitinho Fucking steamroll is gonna go crazy. I believe, bro. I believe. I'm a Giants believer. On to the next group. This shit is easy. EGB FPX. FPX poverty team into losers bracket. Don't win a single game. T1 versus Foot. A, a rematch, I believe. I'm wrong. I'm stupid. I was talking about this earlier. I think that T1 got fucked like super unlucky last split they were like very average like very mid but then they played against the third and the fourth team in the tournament so like that's just, they're just fucked but like t1 can definitely beat foot foot are beating fpx not even close eg are obviously being obviously beating t1 potter supremacy bald head buff type shit bro and then t1 beat foot this is this is my final bro t1 T1 be fought to make it into the playoffs. Another steamroller. How many how many sleeper picks can I pick? I really want Zeta to go through. But it's one of those. It's one of those where like this <sighs> fanatic and energy energy I feel like energy are, are gonna come back with like a vengeance. They're gonna they're gonna tear shit up. But lose a Fnatic, because Fnatic are the best team in the world, unfortunately. Interesting, interesting comp coming out from uh, from Zeta here. All right, I want to I want to see some creativeness. I think ultimately that's what good Valorant comes down to, is like not not set pieces, but how creative can you be in like three v two v threes. 3v4s, like, great Valorant teams win unwinnable rounds. Alright. I've seen enough, bro. Energy are beating Zeta Division for sure. Group of Death, or the group of underperformers, Liquid, Navi. I feel like 
they're both so mid. It, it doesn't matter who I pick. Loud DRX. This matchup happened a year ago. Like, we would be busting a nut in our pants. We'd be going crazy, but it's just not the same. I feel like... Loud. I don't know, dude. Both these, both these teams are so similar to each other. Like, Liquid, Navi are like mid-European teams. And DRX and Loud are teams that should be going good, but have chemistry problems that are like notable. Os Ospos hates his teammates, apparently. And DRX can't decide what players they want to play. Can Liquid beat these lineup fucking Larrys? Because like at this point, everyone knows that DRX are lineup Larrys. Now that I'm looking at this this uh, Liquid roster, I feel like they're kind of mid. We're locking it in. I'm going DRX. DRX allowed to make it through. These are my pickums for fucking groups, man. I don't know if this is like... This feels like... I think this is right. Like, I feel like people are sleeping on T1 a little bit. Because they forget that they played a super... They played in a super hard group. And then can I not do playoffs? Hold on, let me tweet this shit, bro.